The reason I love Ask the Moon by Danny Absey is that I think it's incredibly rare that you get 70 years of lyrical inquiry into nearly every stage of our lives because Danny Absey was a poet who, who started writing young in 1948 when he was still in his early 20s and continued this, this constant, as I say, this constant lyrical inquiry of his life as a doctor and as a poet until he died at the age of 91. So as such, as a book, it's incredibly inclusive. There's a real humanistic uh, uh, generosity to his work, but a needling uh, scrutiny as well. So these are poems that seem to say to us, live and laugh and enjoy life, but also never stop inquiring of the dark from which we shine. And I think because he was a doctor and a poet as well, Although they tend to be very physical poems, very much rooted in the physical world, they are always aware of the spiritual. And I think lastly, what I really enjoy about them is that along with the wisdom, there is always wit. There is a ludic sense of play in Absey's poetry. And it's that that I think makes them a wonderful guide for life. So when, so when life has got too noisy and it's got too fragmented and you want that, that exclusivity of a wise and a musical voice in your ear, uh, Danny Absey's poems are quite often where I go for that silence and that focus and, as I say, that guidance to how, I suppose, to how to live a more attuned human life.